Uh, meanwhile, uh, Dave Muscato posted a 40 minute long diatribe about uh, his parents, um, the district attorney who's prosecuting him for being a transphobe and so on and so forth. And our boy Dave, who I don't talk about too much, um, but I have mentioned a couple times before, has, has escalated all the way up to the CEO of Transphobia, uh, lived with TikTok, has found his video and has clipped a little bit out um, and put him on display for, for her followers to make fun of. Uh, I've not listened to this, but I'm sure it's good. Let's take a listen to uh, Dave Moscato. I see that he's dressed in a appropriate cuckold tranny attire already, so this should be good. Really angry. I just learned something, uh, and I just I'm kind of speechless, and I just want to capture some of what's going on and talk about this. So I've just learned that uh, with my court case here, um, they filed the charges in my dead name. Um, I'm transgender. And I used she and her pronouns, and I legally changed my name six years ago uh, to Danielle Tatiana Moscato. You know, uh, this is a weird thing to comment on, but there's something about, like, his, his microphone and his EQ that gives him, like, a really deep podcast feeling to it. It's like his mic is configured to sound like he's on the Joe Rogan show and he's trying to sound like Joe Rogan, which is really weird because he's trying he's trying to pass off as a woman, I guess. Uh, it's just a weird like disconnect between his audio setup and like what he's trying to do. I uh, came out of the closet 10 years ago um, and they filed these charges in my dead name, which is an offensive thing to do to, to bring up somebody's dead name for any reason. I mean, you just don't do it. It's transphobic. It's, it's unkind to all trans people. You just, there's no reason to do that. Um, and anyway, so they filed these charges against me in my dead name. And so I was forced to show up in court and use you know whatever limited leeway I might have with this judge about this to mention that I first need some more time to come up with the money to hire an attorney. I have disabilities. I haven't worked in several years. I'm in the process of applying for disability benefits, but it takes five years on average, and I'm on year seven, and that's just how long it takes. And I'm I'm just I have a GoFundMe and I'm trying to raise the money for an attorney. And I just I said I need some more time. You know, this was very unexpected. And uh, second, I, I apologize for, you know, being a, a stickler about this, but you're dead naming me in these charges. That is not my name. I legally changed my name 60 years ago. This is offensive aside from inaccurate. It's transphobic and I'm really pissed off about it. We need to fix my name on here. So I showed up in court and I had to explain this and the judge seemed to, to be can someone explain? I, sorry if I missed it. What was he charged with? Is he charged with? I think he's charged with trespassing because he keeps going. He has this weird thing where he's like been living with his rich doctor father that he keeps accusing of rape. And despite living in his father's basement, he was like accusing his father of being a rapist and trying to ruin his professional career. So I think he got con accused of uh, trespass because he keeps coming back to the house that he's not allowed at. Charge with factory. <laughs> okay with it, at least. Yes. I brought my ID that has my name, Ta Danielle Tatiana Moscato, on it to show him. And he ordered that they change the name. And I know, I know that the detective knows that I'm trans. Now I know with 100% certainty that the prosecutor does too. Because she was right there when I said this. So the judge ordered that they change the name on the, on the filing. And they did. And I just found out they changed it to Danielle, which is my new first name. Brian, which is my dead name, middle name. Moscato, which is uh, hasn't changed. Oh, no. Dead middle name. I, I've actually. OK, listen, I've been a professional transphobe for several years now. And I pay more attention to this dumb shit than any person should. I have never. Honestly, I have I have no recollection recollection of ever hearing someone complain about being dead middle named. 
That's really just crazy, chat. That's some that's some bullshit. So they made up a third name that is neither the name that the judge ordered them to change it to, nor my actual legal name, Danielle Tatiana Moscata. They changed it to my dead name for my middle name, my new first name for my first name, my actual first name that is my legal first name, and my last name. And I'm just I'm so pissed. Like they they were told to fix this because this is insulting and offensive to trans people and inaccurate and they didn't they fucked it up again there's no way there's this incompetent i mean there's no way you you don't dead name somebody twice by accident in writing after you're told fix this we might get sued I'm so angry. There's no way this is an accident. This, they're sending me a message that I cannot expect fair treatment in this courtroom as a trans woman. Based. That they do not care that they're being offensive to trans people and to me personally. They want to send me a message that I am not going to be treated fairly here because I'm trans. That they are okay in writing with insulting me as a trans woman because Fuck you, that's why. Do you think that Dave feels heckin' validated that, um, that lives of TikTok made fun of him? Is that, like, the most... That should be considered, like, the most uh, gender-affirming, like, like true and affirming um, euphoria that you can get. Like, oh my god, I'm such a disgusting ogre tranny that I'm... And I've ended up on lives of TikTok. That's, like... That's like making it. That's like the elite four. You made it to the the end. That's the end game. Being a gross tranny. You're being you're being made fun of by little TikTok on Twitter, and you have like forty thousand likes on your posts and shit. <laughs> Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CAC Lofa. Remember to like and subscribe.